Hello students, welcome back. In the previous videos, we have learned how to add one digit numbers and two digit numbers. In today's class, let us understand how to add three digit numbers. Look at an example here children. Add 143 plus 354. First we will write their place values as three digits are there. Three place values will be there that is 1, 10 and 100. Yes, we will arrange the numbers according to their place value. 143. So, 1, 100, 4, 10 and 3, 1. Next, 354. 3, 100, 5, 10, 4, 1. We have to arrange in the same order. Yes. Now, we need to add these two numbers to get their total. Yes. Don't forget to write the plus sign. Now, what is 3 plus 4? 3 plus 4 is 7. Remember what did we learn in the previous class? We should always start adding some one place. Yes. Then move to tens place and then to next place value. Right. So, 3 and 4 are the numbers in one place. So, when we add 3 and 4, we got the answer 7. Next, we will move to tens place. What are the numbers in tens place? 4 and 5. What is 4 plus 5? Yes. 4 plus 5 is? 9. Next, 100th place, it is 1 and 3. What is 1 plus 3? 1 plus 3 is 4. So, when we added 143 plus 354, we got the total at 497. Cut another example here. At 237 plus 600. 52. Here in 652, 2, 1, 5, 10, 600. Right? And 237, 7, 1, 3, 10, and 200. Right? Now, let us arrange these numbers according to their place value. 1, 10 and 100. So, first we will write 237. Next, 652. And we will add both the numbers to get their total. What is 7 plus 2 children? Remember children, we should always start adding from the smallest value that is 1. Then move to 10 and then to 100 place. Now tell me what is 7 plus 2? 7 plus 2 is 9. Next move to 10 place. What is 3 plus 5? 3 plus 5 is 8. And what is 2 plus 6? 2 plus 6 is also 8. So, here we added 237 plus 652 and we got the total as 889. Look at one more example. Add 122 plus 431 plus 24. Here are three numbers which need to be added. The numbers which we will be adding are called as addend. A D D E N D S. Addend. So we need to add here three addends and find out their total. So here in 24, 4, 1, and 2, 10. And in 431, 1, 1, 3, 10, 400. 
and in 122 2 1 2 10 and 100 here in the first number and the second number, there's three digits, but in the third number, it's only ones and tens, means two digits. Now, we'll arrange these numbers according to their place value, one below the other vertically. So, here, ones, tens and hundreds. 122, 431 and 24. 24 you need to write according to their place value only. Yes? Instead of writing 24 here, you can't write 24, 2 in 100 place and 4 at 10th place. This is wrong. Because 4, 1 means it has to be under 1 column only and 2, 10 means 2 has to be under 10th column only. Now, we start adding from 1 place, then move to 10th place and then to 100th place. Now, what is in 100th place? 2 plus 1 plus 4. What is 2 plus 1? 2 plus 1 is 3 and 3 plus 4 will be 7. Right? What is 2 plus 3? 2 plus 3 is 5. 5 plus 2 is 7. Right? Here 1 plus 4 is 5. And there is nothing at 100th place here in the third number. So we will consider it as nothing. 0. Right? So 4 plus 1, 5. That's it. So we will write here 5. So when we added 122 plus 431 plus 20. Four, we got the total as 577. We add the number and write as it is. Yes, students understand when we add two or more numbers, if the sum means total of the digit is 9 or less, then it can be written as it is. If you get 8, you can write as it is. 9, you can write as it is. But if it goes more than 9, like 10, you can't write the 10 as it is under one, one place value. So what can be done will be learning that in the next classes. For now, you understand when we add two numbers, if the total if the total of the digit is 9 or less than 9, we will write the total as it is. And it is called addition without regrouping. Without regrouping or even simple addition. As we will be just adding two, two or more numbers and writing their value. Thank you children.